There are uh, health fears as far as Queen Elizabeth II is concerned. She's been kept under medical supervision. Uh, this is the top international story as of this moment. The Queen uh, remains uh, at her uh, Balmoral residence. This is uh, her Scottish Highland retreat. Uh, the statement says that she uh, remains there comfortable, but there is a fear which is growing uh, for Queen Elizabeth II after Buckingham Palace has said that uh, her doctors were quote-unquote concerned for her health and recommended that she remain under medical supervision. Uh, she is uh, the head of state, the Britain, uh, Britain's longest serving monarch and she has been, uh, she's been suffering with, uh, with health problems since last October. Uh, which uh, prevented her from uh, standing for a very long time and struggling to walk. Uh, very recently was seen uh, when Liz Truss went uh, to seek her blessings at the Balmoral residence. Now, one will have to wait for any official word from the doctors beyond the statement that we already have of uh, of the Buckingham Palace. In the meanwhile, Prince William and uh, Prince Charles are on their way to meet the Queen in Scotland. Nidhi now joins us with all the latest. Nidhi, uh, any update that we have? Well, uh, Sanket, what we're getting from the British media at the moment is one, uh, the fact that uh, you know Buckingham Palace issued this statement at all is itself uh, an indication of how serious it is, simply because they very rarely make public statements on the Queen's health, and therefore the fact that they've said that she's under medical supervision, that her doctors are concerned, uh, that's the first sign that things are not okay. In fact, uh, the BBC interrupted its regular programming when that announcement came, and uh, you know gave this news to view. Uh, that the Queen was uh, not well. Uh, immediately after that, the news started coming in that Prince Charles and Camilla were already there at Balmoral in Scotland and uh, that the rest of her family, all her children, including Prince Andrew, her youngest son, Prince Edward, uh, Princess Anne, uh, all of them uh, have rushed to Balmoral to be with her. Uh, Prince William and Kate, uh, his wife, are also on their way, uh, as is Prince William's younger and estranged brother, Prince Harry, and his wife, Meghan Markle, who happened to be in the UK uh, for some other events at this time. So they're all now going to Balmoral to be by the Queen's side. Again, an indication um, that obviously her, uh, her health has deteriorated significantly. As you mentioned, Sanket, uh, she hasn't been well for some time. She's 96 years old. Uh, she uh, 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 has seen uh, some very difficult times with her health actually in the last one year or so, uh, soon after the death of her husband, Prince Philip, uh, who, who died at the age of 99 uh, last year in April. And since then, we've seen, you know, lots of uh, news coming out about uh, her uh, inability to, to work for long hours. Uh, she's cancelled a number of public engagements or put them off. And this year, in fact, was her platinum jubilee, um, 70 years uh, as uh, the monarch of Britain, the longest serving monarch uh, in the UK. Um, uh, Queen Elizabeth II has really created history. She's uh, seen as many as 15 prime ministers uh, during her reign, uh, and it has been uh, quite a, a, you know, an, an incredible career lasting through the decades. So, uh, you know, th th this is what this year has represented as far as, you know, she's concerned. And that last photograph that we have of hers is the one on our screens uh, of her uh, formally appointing Liz Truss uh, as the Prime Minister of Britain. So this photograph was taken on Tuesday. And in fact, right after that, she had some virtual meetings scheduled as well, which she cancelled uh, because of her ill health. So, uh, those, I, I think, are live shots also coming outside uh, Buckingham Palace, uh, where at the moment you don't see much activity except some tourists, but she's not there. She's at Balmoral, and uh, that, that is her, her home in, in Scotland. And as we said, uh, her entire family, her entire immediate family now rushing to be by her side, Sanket.